Hi, in this video we're going through how to get gold in the GTA Flight School mission, Skydiving, where we'll jump out of a perfectly good plane. Hi and welcome back, my name's Dan and I'm an old, grumpy gamer. Grand Theft Auto is a truly massive game. Between GTA 5 and the constant updates for Rockstar for GTA Online, there's no shortage of new content and interesting things to do. Join me then in our continuing series, Getting Gold in Every Damn Mission in GTA 5 as we look at the Grand Theft Auto mission, Skydiving. Before we dive in, if you're new to the channel, we do how-to guides, news, and giveaways. So consider subscribing and ringing the bell to stay up to date. Getting gold in this mission is not as straightforward as it looks, and it took me quite a few goes to get it right. To get gold, we'll need to land within three meters of the target zone. So let's start with the briefing. Alright, sounds easy, looks easy, not actually easy. So we'll start just by jumping out of the uh, the chopper. And off we go. So into a dive to start with, just to get through it a bit quicker, because there's no time limit on this one. It really is a case of getting the landing right. Okay, so we should level out. I can see the marker in the distance, so we'll just pull a chute and make our way over. Now you can see the controls top left there, uh, it's important these differ between PlayStation, Xbox and PC. And it really very much is a case of just lining yourself up. So the way I tend to do this is I try to keep the marker about halfway between the top of the parachute and Michael. And that tends to get me pretty close to the mark. And then we just make some adjustments a bit later on with the uh, by slowing down. Alright, so we're lined up there can clearly see the yellow marker is now very very clear in place so i'm just placing michael try not to shoot people uh so just lining up and placing michael in the right spot and again this is where it does take a bit of practice so now we can start slowing down and again don't shoot wrong buttons there we are it's slow right down slow down further and then when you get close there we go you can just drop and there we are, that's gold. Now, again, this did take a couple of goes, so don't be surprised if it uh, if you don't get gold on the first pass. So, what are your thoughts? Do you have any tips for other viewers, or could this have been done differently? Leave your comment down below. And check out the video on the left for the next mission, Drop Zone, or the one on the right for some old Grumpy Gamers goodness. Stay safe, wash your hands, and we'll see you in the next video.